Everybody, it's Cubic Tom. Switch Palace. I have no idea which one it is. Let's see. Okay, we have this music. Oh, is uh, I wasn't paying attention. I was looking at my text file. Uh, this here must be the Grey Line Art Palace by Cherno and Septentrion Playdays, which is what I mistook Yope's level for last time. Fair enough. This makes more sense. Line art, greyness. I could be wrong though, because there are rainbow colours and I think there's a thing called the Rainbow Star Palace. Oh, they're solid. Oh, there's more of you. Uh, which way do I go? This way, maybe? Let's avoid the steep slopes. I'm reckoning those blue lines down there are actually holes. I wasn't sure if this was a spike or not. That's good. Uh... Oh! I don't know why I didn't make a demo. Well, it looks like you can go left or right at the start. There could be a power-up to the left. Let's try the left. Um, but first, we just wait a second to deal with those guys. There might be stuff in the other direction. Looks real tricky to go in that direction though. Well, let's... Let's... Uh, no, there's literally nothing over here. Let's test if this is a hole. It is. Okay. All the necessary learning debts are out of the way. Now we can continue with the level legitimately. That's how this works. Alright, so again, just wait a second. And go. Well, it looks like this is going to be the level with, of awkward jumps. Also, is there stuff I can reach up above? There are no parrots or treasure chests in these levels, so maybe I don't have to worry about that sort of thing. Alright, I can't reach anything up there. Well, let's continue on for real. Uh, do I want to bounce on the guide to get over there, or can I just, like... Just slide and... You didn't jump, Demo. Um, maybe I should try bouncing on that green guy? No, that's a really short, easy jump. What am I... <sighs> you know, I need to play Super Mario World games slightly more often, you know? <laughs> So I, I can actually get good at them. Yeah, let's leave that guy alone. Let's see if I can land on the green guy. Hooray! And the blue guy. Yeah, so we're going to be dealing with these awkward steep slopes. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I don't approve. Oh. Uh, hmm. I don't approve. I'm going to scroll the screen next time I get there. Just pay attention. Yeah, so... I have no idea how... Whoa, well, I have no idea how long this level is going to be. Let's go for the green guy again. There we go. Right, so... Yeah, you, you all... Okay, if I stay down the corner, I'm fine. I just want to get rid of them. Then it'd be easier to move forward. Scroll the screen and stay absolutely still. Well, I messed that up. Oh, I thought you'd make it. I'm gonna have to bounce on one of those dudes or something. Oh no, ha. Huh. Slopes are finicky. I forgot about the hole. Man, I'm dying a lot right to start, aren't I? Well, let's see if I can actually make this jump. Yeah, like it's not a difficult jump. Demo, it's not a difficult jump. And this isn't difficult. Wow, why aren't you making it up? I'm starting to get the feeling that um, this level is not supposed to be hard and I'm just like not able to play Mario games today. Like they're all easy to do with enemies and I even know where they're positioned. Uh, I think today is just not my day because this is not difficult at all. Um, like objectively this is not meant to be hard. It's just a couple of enemies and you jump on them. And there's a few jumps, and you just do the jumps. And later on, there's a bit of timing. 
where you have to do things right. Now the slopes make things a bit trickier, but as long as you're facing the slope and you press the button, you know, things will work out. So here, uh, oh, use respond. Oh, there we go. Uh, why? Like I was facing the slope and I was pressing the jump button a few times. No, oh, uh, I keep forgetting that those holes don't affect those guys. Oh, you can go through those. Oh, okay. Now I know. Ah, oh, again. Hooray! Progress! Uh, I can't remember where it's safe down below. Now I know there are no power-ups yet, but... Oh, I thought I'd land on them. I know there are no power-ups yet, but these aren't difficult to deal with enemies, so I don't mind the lack of power-ups. Um, like, I can see why the level maker might think you won't need them. Like, these aren't problematic to deal with. They're slow-moving, and you spin them on them, and they're gone. Um, it's the slopes which make this a little bit dangerous. And you have to react a little bit, that's all. Whoops. Steep slopes are dangerous in Super Mario World. Oops. Oh, come on. Make the jump demo. Slightly too early. There we go. See, it's not difficult to get here. Now, this time, don't mess up these simple jumps. Uh, I know there are spikes and all. Well, not spikes, but, you know, slopes. But it doesn't matter. Is that guy ever going to go anywhere useful? No. Like, just keep on... Oh. I'm, I'm so bad at judging these slopes. Good job. I hate those slopes. Like they're they're much, and it looks like I'm, it's just me flailing about as usual. But it's actually how those slopes work. And um, they are in the original Super Mario World, but they are always used in places where if you mess up on the slope, you fall onto a safe spot. Whereas in Super Mario World Rom Hacks, they are used to make you panic. Um, great. Come on, get up. Demo, no. And then see, like I tried to land on the edge there and Demo just sort of glitched around and fell because reasons. Well, you didn't, you missed. Oh man. Okay. Okay. No, I... Like that slow, that jump there only seems to work. Um, actually, let's do this again. Okay, maybe not do that again. Um, that, that weird double slope jump back there only seems to work if Demo has momentum going up the slope or something. It's kind of weird. Okay, um... Hey, progress. Oh, more, more of these slopes, folks. Ah, I shouldn't have tried to make that. Whoa. Uh, those slopes are kind of glitchy. Did you know that? You won't jump when... Okay, just wait a second. Okay, make it ah, uh, please demo. Like it does not take long to get here. Just don't mess up when you get here. That's that's all you have to do. So wait for the fire to go away, and then it's like basic jumps. All right, here the jumps are ah oh, man, those slopes. Whoa. I just fell right through the middle of those slopes. 
They are so glitchy. Oh, don't fall in. Oh, you were... Come on. Come on, fire thing. Right, just don't... Mess up on the slopes. Okay, more... Just wait a second there, Demo. Just, just try not to glitch through the slope. Oh, whoa, there's a lot going on down there. Oh, okay. Um, I better go life farm, I guess. And we're back. Come on. Come on, make it. Oh, don't die here. Okay, so here it's just a matter of dealing with a whole bunch of steep slopes. Oh, damn it. Like, I was holding... See, I was holding left and I kept pressing the jump button, but occasionally it doesn't work because steep slopes. Can't help but notice I'm complaining about the one thing quite a lot. But, um, I just want to say I'm not mad at the level. I believe it is entirely my fault. I don't have experience dealing with those things. So, um, so this is the result. This happens every time I come across something new that I'm not particularly good at dealing with. Okay, if I can get back here that quickly, it would be fantastic. No! Oh, misaimed. So my goal now, I think it's actually possible to do quite a bit of this level without touching those slopes. I'm just going to try to avoid them for a little bit. Just to, just to experiment, like I'm draining lives anyway, so may as well experiment. Ah, you heard the jump noise, but what really happened was Demo warped downwards. Oh. Come on, don't. Don't die to one of these. No! Come on, Demo. Man, why can't those guys just go away? Because it's really hard to jump up there. Because they sort of both hover around the edge. And then you're dealing with slopes, so... Perfect. Just go away from the edge please because I need to actually get up there and the fact that you just go hover around the edge firing fire everywhere really doesn't help because you have a pointy slope right below you oh boy yeah like what can I do there like when you touch the slope it, it's not like every other slope in the game where you just land in the position you're in it seems to either force demo to go upwards or downwards rapidly well if I could Oh, come on. I wish I could respawn those two poopers, because they would help a lot. Oh, great. Oh, come on. Alright, what I want to do is resummon those green Koopas, if at all possible. Ah, uh, see, I just land on the slope and I clip upwards or downwards or whatever. I need to use those Korean Koopas to hop over everything. Um, like, I, I'm going to try very hard to land on this slope and get up there and bounce on one of those. But... Oh, no. <sighs>
Hey! Is this new stuff? Hey, this is a place I can stand. That's on the slope. Right, let's land on top of this um, grinder over here. What's going on here? The level just keeps on going. Uh, uh, I, I'm, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. I've um, been recording for quite a while. Lost well over 100 lives. Um, if the level ended just after there, I would have said it's a good level. But I think that because... Like, I know I've lost a lot of lives. And I know it doesn't have a power-up. But I don't think it needs a power-up. The enemies are easy enough to deal with. Um, problem is, I have no experience dealing with those slopes. So I'm learning as I'm going along. Um... Like, I'm learning that if you land on them in certain ways, they glitch out. I don't know. Um, how far, how much more of the level do I have left? Does anybody know? Um, yeah, so... I, I don't know what to say. I'm not mad at the level. Um, I'm just... All those deaths were completely my fault because I'm rubbish at Super Mario World games, as you all know. Um, there's going to be a lot of background noise from now on, which is why I'm stopping. But... Uh, this video might continue with no commentary, or maybe not. We'll see what mood I'm in in five minutes. Anyway, talk to you all soon.